Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I'm Kate Kami and today we're going to be continuing our Let's Play series in the game Palea. If you're enjoying this series, please don't forget to like this video and consider subscribing to my channel for more of my videos and streams. So we just had a, 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 a patch release that, that happened, goodness, fairly recently. And so what it's going to do is we, we get a new temple. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. So we're going to quickly, hello, honey. We're going to quickly update our garden here at, or refresh it. How about that? And then we're going to go see A, what Ani wants, and let's see if we can get this Temple of the Roots uh, quest line started, because I'm excited. I think that's actually kind of cool. Oh, we do have some wall -ish, wallpaper stuff we have to do. Okay. Looks like we don't have too much to upgrade in the house. So, or not the house, the garden. So that's, I guess, good. We do have some rice, so we will grab those seeds. We'll start working on this real quick. Oh, we never upgraded our tools. All right, we're gonna get ready for an adventure. Our goal today is to do the Temple of the Roots. At least get through the temple. We're gonna see what that does. So, yeah. I think it's going to be a good day. I'm excited. Anytime we get a new temple or a major content update, uh, it's always a good day, right? So, should be fun. Alright. Work through this, this garden here real fast. And that one there. Luckily for us, we don't have that much that needs to be done. <laughs> so I guess that's a good thing, right? Let's see. Uh, carrots were on the list. Let's grab some of those. There we go. Yeah, I think a lot of the other stuff is pretty much done. We may need to do blueberries. I get the feeling blueberries might be on the menu today. Is there anything else besides that? Uh, the bok choy in the middle. Let's grab that as well. So, that, that. Let's see. That's the Napa cabbage. Here's our bok choy. And I actually was playing around on the garden planner and I may switch some of these back. Um, the Napa cabbage and the bok choy isn't really serving us too well. And I think we'll make, keep enough of it just to do the um, the recipes, the new recipes that we got. But outside of that, like gold-wise, I'm not quite sure if that's really getting us what we need. And so I'd like to start doing some... Uh, I hate to say it, some stats on it. I'm kind of curious to see if there's anything out there. If you know or heard of anything, let me know. Because I'm actually kind of curious to see if there's recent stats. Because obviously they've had a lot of um, updates and changes to like the costs and the buying of things. Or how much things sell for. But... If someone's got like some more recent updated data, I'm looking for some info. If not, we'll just have to start collecting it on our own, which is fine, you know, it's no big deal. But why reinvent the wheel if we have, you know, if we don't have to? It's kind of a thought. Okay, that one. There, we'll get this group. And this one here. Oh, I guess I should have went in the middle there. Oh well. Piece of cake. We got it. Let's refill this. Let's take a look at what we have here. 
seed wise, we got our pepper seeds. I think I may put some more blueberries in here just cause we did use two bushes or we did place uh, two bushes. So there's our four. Oh, we do have some wheat, always good. We don't have any more to throw in there though, sadly. Rice, we did use some rice. We can definitely throw more in here. And let's see, rice seed 17, okay. Eight, and eight. So let's see, we'll do one carrot. We need, actually we're pretty good on the rest. I think we're doing pretty good. I may put a couple cotton in there. That's six, 16, we'll do one more. There we go. One cotton goes three, three, six, nine. That'll get us close. Okay. And what I wanted to use that for, oh good, we do have some, we do have sheets of cotton. I wanted to make some bug catchers or some more bug bags. Cause I don't know what we're gonna need as far as um, supplies or materials for this dungeon. So I wanna make sure that we are prepared. I'll make one more set of the other arrows. Last time we needed arrows, so I don't want makeshift arrows. Where's the good ones? Fine ones, here we go. Yeah, we'll make another 20 of those. And I just wanna make sure we are just per, we are really prepared and ready to go. We can sell this. Got enough cotton, I may just make some more of that. There we go. Um, final check, I feel like I'm all scattered. Final check here. We got 20 there. Let's check our jams. We got some apple jam, which we will actually sell this time. Put some tomatoes in there. We got some pickled tomatoes, okay. I'm gonna wait on some of this stuff. I don't know what all we need or what we're gonna have to craft. So we're gonna have wait on a little bit of this. Just to make sure we have our resources ready to go. Mm, yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Sounds good on paper, right? <laughs> Might as well make it uh, official. All right, so we're gonna sell these. We got some jam here. I may take two. There we go. So now we have focus food. We are going to repair all of our stuff. 166, so we need 100. So let's make some repair kits. And I'm gonna use this one because it's a little cheaper. We're gonna do three. Yeah, that should do it. Okay, there's 120 with our 188. There we go. Fully repaired. Whew. And then we did add the little, the new little uh, things to our house. I feel like I'm being rushed. I want to get into this content. We do have a little spot here. I'm thinking about maybe making that a pantry for maybe some of this stuff. Then the bedroom, maybe a closet of some kind, but we're gonna have to rearrange all of this. This was my original plan before the uh, content drop. <laughs> oh well, it's okay. We'll figure it out eventually, one day at a time. I think we are good. Let's talk to Ani. I was hoping to talk to you today. Good thing you're here, Kikami. You won't believe what, Naj what Najuma just told me. Did she show you her latest invention? Did she show you some blueprints? Did she stare at you and say nothing? Uh, let's ask her, did she show you her latest invention? No, she said that's top secret. But then she told me something else, something really, really cool. She said a bug got stuck in her workshop chimney. A bug? 
So she let it go. And then it dropped a sprout. And then she planted it. And it turned into a whole flower. Isn't that awesome? Huh. A new phenomenon. I say that's amazing. I knew you'd think so too. Obviously, I wanted to see that awesomeness for myself. N Najuma said it was a common blue butterfly and that the sprout turned into a gardenia. But, and she said not every bug drops something. So I'm gonna have to get a lot of them. Ooh, interesting. So they did add, um, besides the Temple of Roots, they added flowers and uh, flower gardening and I think some tree gardening into, into the game. And supposedly if you talk to Bedrew, that's kind of how you unlock all of this. But it looks like the bugs drop the flowers. So this is actually kind of fascinating. It's not my fault. Butterflies are just so dang hard to catch. So I'm personally tasking every member of the Killama Bug Scouts with par participating in this super important mission. All right. That means you too. Wait, I know. <laughs> yeah, let's do this. Yes! I love how excited he is. Catch as many butterflies as you can, and we'll see if they're dropping gardenia sprouts. We can do it. Promise you'll come back? Catch blue butterflies until you get a gardenia. Suspicious symbosis. I guess this is how it starts. Let's see what we get. So we are going to need the uh, bug, bug uh, catchers. I'm glad we did that. Good thing there's a lot of blue butterflies around. Now, he said it was Najuma, so I'm assuming it's going to be in Bahari Bay and not here in Kilama. So I think, yeah, I think we go to Bahari Bay. I think that was our clue there. I hope we get cool flowers like that. Oh, it would be so cool. So nice. I've been saying for a while I would love to decorate with some flowers around our place, and so this is really exciting. I can't wait, you guys. This is going to be fun. Let's grab our bug kit. So blue butterflies. Select the edit button on the emote wheel. Oh, yeah. Uh, let's grab our little bug kit. Let's do this. How many do you think it's going to take? What are your guesses? <laughs> I'm guessing maybe about five or six. Ten? Five, six, ten? Oh, there's one. There's two. Is it gonna take a rare one, you think? Oh, just one? Man. Plant and grow the gardenia. I thought this was going to take longer. I was a dud. Well, we got really lucky. I guess, right? I'll take lucky. <laughs> if you've done this, how many uh, butterflies did you have to catch? I'm curious. Ooh, I wonder where we're going to plant this. Do we have to plant it in uh, our garden? Or can we plant it somewhere else? Or do we plant it somewhere else? Hmm, I guess there's only one way to find out, right? We're gonna give it a try. And I have not watched any videos or anything else on this so far, so we are playing this a little blind. Today is the day of the patch. So you got kind of an idea of the recording of this. I'm sure by the time I edit this video and get it all posted, 
I think this content will be out for about a week because I usually record about a week ahead um, just to make sure I have time and everything else. But yeah. Hmm. <laughs> so we are playing this a little blind. Actually really blind. I kind of like the... this fun. Right? Why not? So we got our gardenia plant. Now if we can't plant it in the... in here... I say we try placing it right here, right? We're gonna replace this any- oh whoops. We're gonna replace this spot anyways, so we might as well pull that out. There we go. Four. Can we place that? <gasps> Something is in the way. What? G examine. Oh. Okay, so you plant it as a sprout. Ah. Interesting. Okay. So, we're going to replant that. That's fine. Which is fine. Six. Yes, please. We'll put that in there. We'll water this. Where do we want our gardenia to be? Ooh. Four. Let's plant it. I wish I could put it in a planter. Nah. All right. Let's place it. We'll put it right here. Can we put it right here? How about right by our? How about right here by our pond? We'll make it at this our little spot. Oh, you do have to water it. Okay. <gasps> uh oh. Let's do a, what is it? X, there we go. Can we inspect it? We can't inspect it, we can't do anything. Maybe it takes a day to grow. We just gotta remember that it's there. That's the biggest uh, trouble we're gonna have. Can we catch more? Plant and grow the gardenia. Well, we planted it. Maybe it'll take a day cycle. Hmm. <laughs> An adventure awaits. <laughs> Let's go talk to Badru while we're at it. Since we know he had some extra stuff, I'm curious to know what he has. Or, or he's got some, he sells some other stuff. Oh, it's now dark. I don't know if anything else will give, um... Will give any kind of... Mm, bonus. Sorry, I was trying to find Gina. I was like, hmm, yes. Hey, it's good to see you again. I always look forward to seeing your face. But you know, like a normal amount, not a creepy inappropriate amount. I don't like have a crush on you or anything. Oof, did I say that out loud? I'm gonna stop talking now. So Sounds quiet now. All right. I thought maybe she had uh, something to say about the subject. Maybe I'm Eloisa so does. close to uncovering the truth. I can feel it. Hello, hello. You have caught me at just the right time. Did you sell those triangles yet? Yes, I did. Good! You have made this village a safer place. Apparently, Zeki forbade his mother from selling me more of them, so we'll have to make our own for everyone else. Uh -huh. I already asked Sifu if she could put together a mold. Awesome! Think outside the box, my friend. Will do. Alright, so none of them know of any kind of butterflies dropping into seeds. Hmm... We were going to talk to Bedru. Hey, Asan. We have much to discuss. Why were you away so long? Tao missed you. Oh. Uh. I'm lucky I spend so much time in nature. Mm. Otherwise, I might never have found the forest grove. And if I hadn't found the forest grove, we'd have nowhere to talk alone. Uh, okay. 
Keep an eye out for any pesky choppers. All right. Hey, Tao. Ah. Ruff, ruff, ruff. Woof, 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 woof. I'm happy to see you too, buddy. Arf, arf, arf. Happy Tao. Aw. There's Shane. Is Bedru in here? No. Hmm. Bedru might have went to bed. Yeah, they're all at the house. Let's see. No, he's still up. Let's see if we can catch him real fast. Oh, there's no sprint. I was hitting my Final Fantasy sprint button. <laughs> this is the problem when you play too many, too many games. <laughs> oh. Oh well. Um, I get the feeling we're going the wrong direction. Yeah, I think we're gonna go that way. Let's go this way. Let's try going in the right direction. Stay awake, Bedru. Just just a little bit more. Keep the eyes open. Do not go to sleep. You shall not sleep. Yay! Here's the good times ahead. It sure has been a while. Let us catch up, shall we? After how you helped me out, I owe you a lot, but unfortunately, all I can offer you right now is dinner. Pull up a chair, we're having baked potatoes and potato soup. Sounds good. Actually, sounds good. Potato bar? Yes. All right, so let's see what he has in his store. Seeds, the plaque, tomato, the well, and the grow house. So nothing new here. Okay. Requirements not met. Level 20. Ooh, we're almost close to the gardener's grow house. By the way. Tomato vines wallpaper. Huh? All right. May your gardens be weed free. Agreed. Oh, does Ani say anything if we talk to him again? Oh boy, I am so glad to see you. No, what's up? You know, Gina said the place I found that statue wasn't a burial ground. It was some kind of big tall house where, where different families lived in different rooms, all on top of each other. No wonder there are ghosts there. I'd haunt people too if I had to live like that. I hear ya. I gotta go beat Nio at card. I wish I didn't. <laughs> it's kind of a sad state, buddy. I... Yeah. We won't get into that. <laughs> All right, maybe it's in this store. So at onions, uh, the usual. Here we go, a spring fever wheelbarrow, a swing, and some lights. <gasps> oh, my favorite lights. I love these lights. All right, we're gonna buy the recipes. So we got a spring fever set almost. Oh, I kind of want a few of these. Oh, I can only get one. Oh, it's a recipe. Good. Good, good, good. So we got some recipes. We may actually have to give that a try. I know we've been working through Tish's stuff, but I think we give this a try. Come on. There we go. Whoa! Holy cow! Look at this thing! How can you miss that? Ooh, yes! We need this one! Oh no you don't! Come here! Yes. We need that one for a collection. Look at this. Can you climb it? 
Can we climb it? Curiosity must know. Climb his arm. And make it to the top of the arm. Come on, back with No. <gasps> Ooh, new idea. We're gonna see if we can climb it. This is a st <laughs> This is a fun adventure. I mean, we gotta wait anyways, right? Might as well have some fun. We're waiting for gardenias to grow. And you know, it's not like anyone hasn't tried this already, let's face it. Three, two, one. Yes. Success. We might make it to the top. Let's make it to the top. We shall be king of Frog Mountain. <laughs> oh my goodness, look at this thing. <gasps> oh, what's this? Loot. A Frogbert plush. <gasps> we got a plushie! <gasps> oh, that is awesome. Look at this! See all the Kilima over there. Temples. It's actually really cool how much you can see. Just kind of looking around in the distance. Alright. Do we dare try jumping off? Sure. Let's do one more last look around. Yeah, look at it. I like how his eyes follow you, too. You guys notice that? <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, that is insane. Here. We'll do a... Wait. There we go. We found our thumbnail picture for the day. <laughs> that is so funny. Alright, well, that's new. 100% love it. That is great. Um, hmm. I don't know what to do right now. How do we kick this off? Maybe we'll talk to... I'll talk to the villagers about the big giant frog. I want to see what this plushie is. Garlic. Which we may regret, that's okay. Anything good there? No. I know we're waiting. This direction. See if there's any new... Sometimes you'll find new chests in like weird places. So I know we've seen that too. Nope. All the trees everywhere. Let's talk to Einar. No, that's just a regular manus. Alright, let's see what Einar has to say. He's got something for us. Hey, buddy. What's up? Today is a good day for engaging in the oneness. Salutations, companion. I require assistance of a humanoid nature. I was aspiring for yours in particular. Okay. Before you deliberate, allow me to share facts that you may or may not have become aware of. All Galdor are linked through a network of flow. 
as the sky orb rose today, I received a message th through th said connection. Oh yeah? What the message say? It was distorted and fragmenty, like my current compass comprehension of the circumstances. I have only decoded the word help. Okay. I surmised another Galder has awoken, but I cannot uh, access their emplacement. Since you are an expert at accessing spaces you should not, <laughs> I thought you might be interested in the challenge. Ooh. What kind of space? It's a difficult place to describe. If you could consider a Goldar being born, I would say it was in a spot in which that happened to me. It was a spot in which that happened to me. I have not returned since. Okay, where were you born? This Temple of Roots is secured in a peculiar way. Hecla acquired an additional flow power container from her Gina. Yet, when we inserted it into the intended slot, our passage remained obstructed. Hmm. We require a human to override the lockdown protocol. Why do you need a human to override it? This location is full of stories for many Galder. The human perception was that we might want to acquire access to relieve those memories. That would interfere with operation and thus they took precautions. Huh. Perhaps those precautions are how this Galder found himself encapsulated in a space it did not wish to be. There are three human overseer stations in Bahari, one correlating to each of the other elemental flow structures you have researched. You will need to locate and access them all. There are three overseer stations. So we know we have the water. No, Waves was here in uh, Kilima. There is flames, there was the wind, or air, uh, or gale winds. I wonder where the third one, you'll need to locate and access them all. Okay. To find their locations, you may have to inquire around the village. Perhaps begin with Hecla. Okay. I am meditating in attempts to sense the direction of flow. Perhaps you would like to join me. Oh, good right now, buddy. I agree. Alright, so we gotta ask around the village. Unfortunately, it's midnight. Everybody's sleeping. Nope. Keeper of flames, keeper of gales, flames, and waves. Okay, so waves is right around here. Ask around the village. Hey, Jell! Our chats always leave me inspired. Wonderful to see your joy joyful visage, Cozy Kekami. I'm out looking for materials for my latest creation. Let me know if you spot any Ormu's horn horn kernel. Any Ormu's horn cor coral. Ah, I want to say kernel for some reason. Horn coral. It makes the most beautiful dye. Ormu horn. That's a new... Uh... Hmm. Okay. So how's it going with the dress? Maybe we'll ask him this. You should have seen me earlier, Keikami. I was weaving the teeth into the train, and it felt like the cloth was taking on a personality of its own. Mm. No, no, it was as if the personality had always been there, but it was just getting to know it, helping to bring it to the surface. And then, Esh came to check on my progress. She was horrified. What did you do? Mm. I lied, what else? I told her the design was for another client, and that I'll have her dressed by tomorrow. Oh, what am I to do? Hmm. You know, Ash will be upset if you explain it. I say we give Kenyatta the dress. Let's cause some chaos. You're, of course, right. That would be the courageous thing to do. I will pray to the dragon to give me the courage to stick by my art. I think you should. You were a pleasant break from my woes. If that's what Kenyatta wanted... I know there's a difference between the wearer and the client, and who's paying for it, but still. So we need to talk to Hecla. Hecla's not going to be up for a while. 
Let's go back to the house. Let's check on our gardenia. I have a feeling that's not going to happen until 6 a.m. But more importantly, let's look at our froggy. I want to see our new froggy friend. Let's see, let's see what we got here. This is exciting. So many little things all of a sudden. I like it. I love having all the new quests. Alright, let's put this froggy next to our other froggy. See, we put the plant in that one. Maybe we'll go six. What's this one look like? Oh, he's got a buddy. We can put him over here. Can we put him over here? Come on. Will he fit? Can we, can we wiggle him in there? No, I don't think we can. Wiggle him in there. I guess we're gonna have to make a frog fam family here. Six. <gasps> I should be able to put him right there. No? We can't put him that close? Interesting. Outside the area? What do you mean? I guess. Huh. Let's see. We'll see how close we can get him. We'll put him right there. Does he open his mouth too? Nope. We just got those two. Oh my god, he is so cute. <gasps> if I put him on the chair... What is he, does he fit on the chair? No. That answer is no. Have him sneaking around the thing. There you go. <laughs> He's like the shy frog. Alright, let's check on this gardenia. What's it doing? It's just sitting there. Okay. Let's put our bug away. Put that away. We will go here. We'll put our princess ladybug away. Galdors. Oh, male. Einar. <laughs> here we go. This is our, uh, our big male. Dear Kikami, I do not wish to generate an anxiety within you, but I have been presented with information that may do so. Please translate your corporal form to my location during your earliest point of daylight that is within your convenience. Einar. That's funny. Alright, we did that. So Keeper of the Gales. We can do this. Need gold? Paleo is in a world of abundance. Whoa. We got the huge flag. Which way is it telling us? It's telling us we gotta go that way. No idea. Ask around the village. Yeah, we were gonna go talk to Hecla, I thought. Hopefully that reset the flag. We're gonna wait for them to... Kinda of wake up, I guess. Gina's up. Hecla should hopefully be waking up here soon. We're gonna make our way over there. We are looking for a choppa pile too, by the way. That was kind of the whole point. There we go. I think that's just a regular one. I don't think that's uh Save some of this. Hecla! Buddy! How wonderful to see you. It's, you seem to be requiring my attention. Do you know where any human overseer statues are? 
One, perhaps, Gina uncovered a mysterious chamber at the unnaturally reflective body of water near Kima. Near Kilima. No. Mysterious chamber. Okay. If you access this location, please be sure not to negatively affect my Gina's work. I believe she's still uncovering its secrets. Did you get a mysterious transmission this morning? Indeed. I have not told my Gina of it. I believe she would put herself in danger again. Still, I wish to ensure the Galder that sent the message is unharmed. I know you're uniquely equipped to do so. I will confer with Einar once our doorway is open. Okay. Gina's sleep has been restless lately. I suspect it has something to do with her fears. She will never become a full scholar. I have tried to reassure her, but I think I may have to wait for time to heal this wound. We'll do. So, a spot near and around here. So, last time when we were wandering, we did notice something. And it was kind of close to this mirror ponds. So I think we're going to check there first. That spot was right here. And we have this wave. So I saw this mysterious tunnel. And we have this little waves thing here. So let's see what's in here. Ooh, check this out. Read. Yes, please. I want to read this. Anyone but him. Ugh. Azur. Hephaestus. Hephaestus? Is coming today to install our portion of the Cosmos Protocol. I'm dreading our reunion. It's difficult enough to work with them when we aren't face to face. But now I have to confront it head on. Gotta remember to avoid the use of my old nickname for him. Especially if Anemma comes with him. Hephaestus. Yeah, Hephaestus is coming today to install our portion of the Cosmos Protocol. Dreading our reunion, difficult enough to work. Okay, well, you aren't face to face. All right. Cosmos Protocol, huh? Can we kneel at the shrine? No, can't kneel at the shrine. There's another one here. To Galen. Request denied. I'm so sorry to hear about the struggles you are experiencing. Unfortunately, we cannot provide you with the additional pyroflow at this time. The Aeroflow Research Facility has had similar requests denied. We need to redirect the remaining supply of pyroflow to the right places. It will be dedicated to the war effort where it is, where it is most needed. Apologies, the Minister of Flow. Hmm. So they were running into some issues. I do like that set. Can I read this? No. Anything in here? We have this golder here. I want to make sure we check everything else first. Betrayal. Did the king really do this? I have been in his corner for so long. And now Asta shut off our access to Pyroflow at his command. We've still got our supply of Hydroflow, but now student learning is incredibly limited. I can't provide them with the education we promised. And yet, of course, the Spheerball team is still being funded. I wonder if I should contact my lawyer preemptively or wait for the complaints to roll in. Hmm... So pyroflow versus hydroflow, huh? Interesting. I don't think there was anything else up the stairs here. Yeah, just the one. All right. So we figured that out. Let's talk to the Golder. Serious device. Hello, user. Please enter an action. Uh, log in. Please enter access code letter, code letter by letter. Hint, Hephaestus nickname. Oh no. 
Um, hmm. Well, Anemo was his other. A kind of, you know, fits. Uh, S? Ooh. Hold on. Maybe we should write this down. <laughs> S? Hmm. Please enter access code letter number two. M? I don't know. Please enter access code letter three. How about E? Please enter access code letter four. I don't know. M. Ready to submit. Sure. Code denied. Okay. All right. So this is going to be an anagram. We're going to have to write all of the uh, letters. So first letter, we got E A S R. Go E. S M N A. Okay. T E Y H. And then we got M Y A P. Hmm. That's going to be interesting. Access denied. All right, let's see if there's any clues. The Minister of War, apologies, the Minister of Floor, of Flow. Hmm. Galen. This one was up here. Fades, yeah. He's dreading the reunion. Difficult enough. Face, gotta remember to avoid using my old nickname for him, especially if Anima comes with him. There. Maybe we'll ask. King. I want to just ask the A S T A. A S T A. I wonder if Asta is it, because that's the only other name, and that actually fits. A S T A. That actually fits in our in our thing. Let's try. Log in. Access code. A. S. T. And A. Ready to submit? Yeah. Let's try it. Code accepted. Woohoo! Menu. Welcome, Galen. <laughs> uh, let's check our messages because that sounds fun. Recent messages. Ooh. From Anema. From Anema. Body text. Yes, Galen, they cut off my power flow too. It's incredibly frustrating and has stunted our research significantly. Perhaps we can pool our remaining resources. This meet up, let's meet up for lunch as soon as we can discuss it. Okay. Messages. From Asta. From Asta, I have seen your message. Please enjoy your time off and we can commune 
when you return. I am sorry for my awkwardness. I'm struggling with our situation as much as you are. Okay. From Titus. Heard about your little fight with the king. You sure you want to pick at those scars? From what I hear, he's already pretty whacked out about what happened with his wife. Guy can't catch a break. At this point, we should all take one. I sure am. If you need anything, please contact the gardener directly. Hmm. Picked a fight with the king. Messages. From Admin1. Uh-oh. Admin1. I'm really sorry, Galen, but infighting is not the best use of our time. Please trust me and trust what I am doing is for the survival of our species. We have had things easy for so long, people have forgotten how bad things can get. I promise you the Cosmos Protocol is important. I am converting the university to protect it and protect the civilians inside in case the worst happens. Hmm. Okay. So, let's go. Messages? Nah. Alright, we'll get out of this. Yep. We'll go back to menu. Menu. Welcome, Galen. Let's go to temple status. Temple status overview. Flow generator stab status disabled. Emergency access door powered. Cosmos protocol engaged. Hmm. So the cosmos is engaged. Emergency is open. Flow generator is disabled. Okay. Menu. Garden lockdown protocol. Garden lockdown protocol engaged. Ooh, do we disengage it? Sure. Garden protocol disengaged. Okay. Goodbye. Keeper of waves, quest completed. Okay. Menu. Welcome, Galen. Temple status. Nope, doesn't say anything about that. All right, I guess we're gonna go. Goodbye. Exit. Oh, okay. Sweet. If we talk to him again, do we have to... No, we don't have to input the code again. Bomber. Okay, so we finished that one. Return to Kilma. Yes, please. Let's talk to... No, we don't want to do that. Let's talk to Hecla again. Let's see what she has to say. I'm gonna... Eh, maybe we won't. Maybe we will. Hey, Hecla, you wouldn't believe this. Let me just tidy up first. Oh, greetings, human. Oh. Next time, I will prepare sustenance. All right, nothing there. So we gotta ask about Keeper of Gales and Keeper of Flames. I am wondering, do we talk to... Hmm. Do we go to Bahari, talk to maybe Najuma or to Hodari or Tamala? Or do you think we need to talk to the people we did the temple with? So one would be Sifu and Hassan. Again, both would be good choices. Or do we... Or um, Eloisa and Soleri for the... The um, gales. The gale winds. Maybe we'll ask around. Oh, I know we gotta ask around, but... Hmm. Maybe they'll be able to give us a little insight. Some new tomes you might like. If you're interested in picture books, they are over in the back. Do you know where any human overseer stations are? Hmm. Overseer stations? I didn't see any evidence of those during our silver wing research. Hmm. A second site on the ground would make sense, though. <sighs> Taking natural erosion and time into the account... I'd have, it'd have to be somewhere deep at this point. Maybe in those caves near the geyser. Something below the structures north of the temple entrance, perhaps? Okay. Do take notes if you discover anything. Will do. My sister insists that we host an outdoor fair together. One side dedicated to books and the other to the cabinet of curiosities she's amassed over the years. Sounds like fun. 
fun? The process one must go th through to hold an event is far too demanding, even for me. Not only do we have to find and reserve a venue, but we must market the event to others. This means creating and distributing flyers. Then there's the associated paperwork and fees. My head hurts just thinking about it. Do return right. soon. Why is there a red light over here? Oh, because there's a candle. All right, so we have an idea of where the second one is. I'm wondering if Sifu and Hodari are the other ones. Where is Sifu? Sifu is over at the Reflection Gardens. And Eloisa is over there as well. You know what? Why don't we just go check out the place? We'll go check out the spot she mentioned. And we'll go from there. Should be fun, right? Why not? What's the worst that could happen? <laughs> hmm. <laughs> this direction. I'm going to keep our inventory kind of clear, so I'm not going to pick up any... I'm going to try not to gather. We know how hard that is for me. I'm going to try not to gather too, too much, because I don't know if we're going to get a whole bunch of stuff, if we're going to need things. So, we shall see. Hey, Hodari. Question for you. Dear Kikami. Oh. Najuma don't come into town much. Think all the noise and people overwhelm her. Okay. See you around. So it is the people that we ran into. Hmm. Okay. So if we were talking about the gale winds. My thought would be that it's in those uh, that little cavern. You know how they have that little hidden cavern? Bet you it's in there. It wasn't anything super rare, was it? Nope. You never know. If I do find a rare bug, I will try to catch it. So I am keeping my I do keep my eyes out open for them or out for them. But I don't think we're gonna run into anything too too exciting or crazy. Actually, you know what would be good? No, we're not gonna do it. We're not gonna do it. We're gonna be good. We said we were going to be good. We we're going to be good. So I think it's one of these temples. I don't think she was talking about this. I mean, we'll take a look, but I'm 90% sure it's not this. Yeah, I don't think there's anything in here. Though this is getting quite filled up. Yeah, nothing special in here. Okay. Let us head... We shall head over here. I bet you it's down here. This is what I'm thinking. So there is this little secret hidden kind of little place. I guess it's not so secret anymore. But... We've got this spot. Come around here. 
you go through the vines, you find this, and if you look down, there's the hole. Yep. Fall down here. I'm wondering if there's something here. I thought there would be. This was my guess. I guess not. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. So, I know there's another spot. But it's a little harder to get to, if I remember right. It's kind of like an odd... You have to take the... Um... You have to take the geyser up. There's like a weird glide. A little weird spot that you gotta glide to. It's like a hole. If I remember right. I remember reading something about it. So we just gotta find it. I thought it was down in here. Maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. Hmm. We're just gonna kinda... There we go. See what we get. If we find something, we're gonna go for it. see anything there. Hmm. Yeah, I thought I'd be there. We'll try here. Oh, wait, there. Look at it. There it is. Oh my gosh, that is so hidden. It looks just like the wall. So if you come running through here... Yeah, yeah, yeah. It literally doesn't look like there's anything there. But there it is. Check this out. This is new. Yeah, and there, that's where you go up. Okay. Mm. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're now in the mountain. Check this out. Yep. Mysterious tunnel. Let's check this one. So it looks almost exactly the same. Got some eggs. No, nothing up there. Can we use the same uh, code? Let's read this one. Save the Phoenix. Save the Phoenix, a, a preposterous slogan. Who will save us? Who will save the Silver Wings? This menace that faces our society is unmatched in skill and speed. As, as, our, as our soldiers fall to it, it only becomes stronger. Do we think cutting off power now of all times will make a positive impact on our war efforts? I requested we pivot the research at the facility into finding a solution, and yet I was denied by the Minister of Flow. We are now relegated to, at most, experimenting with Aeroflow. Aeroflow may be the only thing that can save us, and I'm not allowed to pursue it. Okay. I had lunch with Galen today. Things were awkward. I'm not the most adequate social expert already, and and our shared connection with Hephaestus Hephaestus made things a made things a bit more uncomfortable than usual. Sorry about that. I'm just trying to make sure I'm reading this right. Galen is beyond stressed about 
stressed about the ongoings. All right, let's try this again. <sighs> I had lunch today with Galen today. Things were awkward. I'm not the most adequate social expert already, and our shared connection with Hephaestus had made things a bit more uncomfortable than usual. Galen is beyond stressed about the ongoing ons with the Pyroflow generator and their communications. I suggested Galen spend some time in the countryside and away from the front. He may have taken it personally, very personally. He probably thinks I'm trying to get rid of him. I give Hephaestus trouble about how finicky he is, he is with his wording choices, but I'm likely going to spend the rest of the day thinking about how that conversation could have gone better. Okay. Hephaestus. Hephaestus. I'm going to the research facility. Given the sporadic flow gate lockdowns and chaotic state of the countryside, I fear we may not speak again for the time being. If you have come to my office and need anything from my machine, look for the capital. This letter will guide your way there. Take care, dear. We will be reuni reunited soon. All right, so we need to write down these letters. So we got A. We have a C and an E and an R. A, sir. I think that's it. Okay. Let's do it. Hello, user. Please enter an action. Log in. Please enter access code. Hint, look to the capital. Let's go A, C, E, and R. Ready to submit? Yes, let's do that. Code accepted. Yes. Menu. Welcome, Anima. Ah. Messages. Recent messages from Galen. From Galen. Sorry for my behavior at lunch today. I guess I took your suggestion pretty personally. I know you meant well with everything going on. It's nice to have someone with my best interests in mind, even if it is my ex's new partner. I've decided to visit my brother soon. Can you cover for me at the university? Okay. From Hephaestus. From Hephaestus. Your reassurance has kept me strong in a time where I find very little to look forward to. Would you like to get dinner tonight before you go to the research facility? I can come to your office. Vitus could certainly use the walk. Vitus, huh? Messages from Titus. From Titus. Hey yo, keep me updated on your Aeroflow experiments. I think a Galder running on Aeroflow instead of Terraflow might be able to fly. How useful would that be? Serious question. I haven't thought of a use case yet. <laughs> and then finally, from admin one. From admin one. Body text, one of two. I know the potential for your research to help the war effort, but you have done so much amazing work in the pursuit of knowledge. The Cosmos Protocol is designed for what comes after all of this. It is designed so that your research will be preserved in the hopes of a better future. There will come a time when our paths separate and the flow gates cease to operate. When this time comes, I want you to remember how much I trust in you. Thank you for trusting in me. Okay. Temple status. Temple status, flow generator, restabilized. Emergency access door, powered. Cosmo protocol, engaged. Please contact the capital. Oh. Menu. Lock garden lockdown protocol. Lockdown protocol engaged. Let's disengage it. Lockdown protocol disengaged. Okay. Goodbye. Cool. Keeper Gale's done. Oh, shoot. Exit. Escape. Okay. So we finished that one. So I think our next goal. Maybe we talk to Hassan. I think Hassan is going to be our next bet. Uh, this way. Yes. Hopefully.
hopefully he is over in his uh, by the spring. Let's see if we can find him. Oh, whoops. Shoot. That's okay. Does this feel like it got... I feel like this has changed. Hmm. Alright. Is the sun over there? I do not see him yet. Okay. Let's see. Is he on this map? No, he is not. Alright, we're gonna have to go bug him back to kill him. Bummer. That's fine. We can go find him. We'll figure out where the next one is. Besides, I like talking to him. those. I am looking for a fairy mantis if we happen to see a rare version of it. Just because it is a little difficult to find. Or we haven't gotten around to it yet. Well, not that we haven't gotten around. It's just that we just haven't spotted one yet, really. Alright. So we need Hassan and Sifu. That's our next two. That's fine. We'll grab one of them. Well, Sifu's right there. We'll go talk to Sifu. She likes adventure. This will be fun. So the king powered down the some of the flows to the different places and there's a war going on that's what we know all we know is that the humans disappeared we were coming back we have no recollection of anything hmm it's kind of interesting it really is kind of interesting We're gonna roam around this direction. Sifu. Oh, are you in the bar? Yeah, you are. Okay. Let's talk to both you and Hassan. Oh no, I guess we're just Here talking to, cause to you. Some trouble. Every day. What can I do for you? Do you know where any human overseer stations are? Oh. Human over what? I haven't seen anything like that. The only human place I've been to recently is that spicy little temple we found, Tawin. Do you think there's more to it? That facility did seem connected to the aqueduct. You never know what might be in the those sewer grates around there. There's sewer grates around the aqueduct? Oh, I know. Yes, there are. Maybe you'll even find one of those monster clowns Ani was telling me about. <laughs> I've been thinking about Talon a lot recently. I just wish I knew what happened to her for sure, you know? At least there's hope. Mm -hmm. That hope is what makes it so hard to move on. It's been nearly a decade, though. I have to push through this. Uh -huh. I have to let her go to feel better. But if I do, I feel like I'm saying what happened between us didn't matter. I wish I could hammer out feelings as easily as a sheet of metal. Let's grab some drinks later. Hmm. Hey, Reth. I guess I can we take need to make sure break. we talk to you. What can I do? What can I do you for? Hmm. Man, I ha I'm really hankering for some food. Made by someone, not me. At a place, not here. Hmm. I get tired of smelling the same thing day in, day out. My nose is always like, come on, Reth, give it a break from the soup already. Oh. Wait, what am I saying? Illicit magic doesn't smuggle itself. Darn right. Hassan. I have a feeling Yet. you won't leave until you've spoken. <laughs> oh, never mind. Get to it. Never mind. Oh. Have you seen my plume hound Tao? He's much more than a pet to me. He's my dear friend and companion. Please alert me if you see him in the forest. 
I wouldn't want any harm to come to him. That's enough socializing for now. All right. So now we have an idea. Uh, yes, we can get get out this way. We're gonna head back. Hmm. So they think it's by the aqueducts and the sewers near the aqueducts. So that's where we're gonna head. I have some ideas of where it could be, but I'm not 100% sure. Really not 100% sure. That's okay, we'll find it. We can find this. <laughs> oh man. Hey, Hodari. So if we head this direction, we got a marker on our map too. I wonder if it's been trying to take us there for a while. I feel like I'm hearing more of the, uh, the Mujin. Does it sound like they're howling to you? I don't know, I'm kind of getting that impression right now. Hodari. Hmm. Oh, hey, we got some of this. Yeah, we'll take some. If we're here, we might as well. There we go. So now we're gonna head out. Is this the aqueducts? No, that's not the aqueducts. Aqueducts is over here. Right, right. Yeah. Crabs. Yeah, see how they have like those little things popping or kind of flowing down there. I'm wondering, is there one that's close to there maybe? Maybe up top? I thought there was. Hmm. Do a quick look here. Maybe not. Because the temple is over here. This is our temple. Maybe we'll try these, uh, the waterfalls around here. That's my first thought. I don't think we're going to be successful, though. I don't really remember seeing any kind of marker. So, we're going to go this direction. Wait for our stamina. There we go. I like to jump. I don't see anything on this side, you know. Am 
Let's jump across. Oh, we're not gonna make it. Crap. Darn. All right, let's go the other side. I'm wondering if there's something on the other side that we can use. Just take a quick look around here, just to make sure. Yeah, no. Okay. Bummer. Ooh. Grab a crab. It is a rare crab. Might as well. Yeah, I'm wondering if it's one of... Oh, hello. As much as I want to, we're not going to do that. We're going to go this way. I want to see if there's anything over here. This was my thought. Hmm. Maybe we go across here. Let's see if there's anything back here. Don't think so, but... I mean, we were just here, and I don't remember seeing anything. But I could be wrong. Got this. There's this phoenix statue. Aqueducts here, perhaps? No, no symbols. My next thought... Maybe up one of these things. Nothing there. Could we make that jump? No. Let's go up. Let's see if there's something over here. Is there a way to get up there, maybe? Not that I see. Maybe something along the wall. I'm looking for anything glowing. That might possibly give me a clue. There might be something there. Hmm. Huh, huh, huh. Where do we think it could be? There? I thought there was... I thought there was like another... Oh, crap. Yeah. thought there was a way. To get... There was another like little mine spot or something. Up around here. Like a taller exit or something. Huh? 
Well, we did this. <laughs> Can we parkour around? Yes. <laughs> well, here's one way. Yeah, I thought there was something over here. I thought there was a... Yeah, looks like it. Looks like you have to get there, though, from inside. Let's go inside the mines. We gotta go up. Let's try going up. I don't know if this is gonna get us anywhere. Or if we're even close. But... We are going to try. I know there's this route. That goes up. Hoping this is the same route. Yeah, there's that. I think we go this way. Really, we should just do this from the other side. Where we know we can make it. That's okay. We'll make it work. We'll just stay here for a second. Okay. Up and over. X. There we go. Made it there. Now, there's a spot over here. Oh. We might have messed that one up. That's okay. We'll see what we get. Nope. Maybe it's this way. Hmm. No. Ah! This way. Up here? No. Yeah, we may have to go through the other, the other side. If we go to the right, we'll be able to get to an opening. No. All right. You know what? We're we're wasting time. Let's go the other direction. Let's get out of here. We could check some of these other little areas. Got that area. Does that actually go up? Sorry, curiosity. Looks like it does, doesn't it? I think that's where we were. Oh well, let's get out. We're goofing around now. <laughs> Ugh. All right. So, if we want to do this, we gotta go upsy daisies. Best way to do that is to go from Najuma's uh, shed. Najuma's place. So let's go from here. There we go. So we got this, and we st I think we still need to go up. Yeah, this will work. Much better. Here we go. So 
So there's this area. Nothing up here. That's where we just came from. There's this one. Nothing hidden over here. Okay. This is where we came from over here with the barrels. Nothing here. All right. Is there anywhere else we could possibly go? Hmm. I thought there was another way up. I could have swore there was another way up. Hmm. Feeling lost. My thought was maybe it was the wall here. One of the aqueduct panels in the wall. Ooh, that was close. Sounds like just on the other side here. Hmm. Oh well. Where could it be? I wonder if this is leading me to it. What do you think? Search this area. Really? All right, let's follow the marker. I just noticed it. I just remembered, well, just remembered we had it. Let's go try that. They must have known. <laughs> they must have known. So the other side, huh? All right. We will check this out. So the aqueduct panels are just right there. If I remember right, I think... Can you just walk over there? Let's find out. Can we... Oh, we're just gonna... Search this area. Oh, hey, fire! All right. Yeah, I was not expecting that one. Mysterious tunnel. Whew! I'm glad we figured that out. <laughs> Just follow the thing. We'll be fine. Ooh. All right, so let's read. Another day, another terrible note sent to the staff. They don't think I, they think I don't care, but I'm simply not allowed to show it. I worry about the other facilities. I worry about Anima. I worry about my employees. We are all at risk and this, and this force working against us, it is impossible to stop. The only thing that brings me to solstice, to solace is Vitus. That dog's loyalty is as infallible as his terrible breath. I wish he could understand just how much his years of companionship mean to me. Oh, poor Vitus. Looking for a clue. Can we get in there? No. 
ex-relationship struggles. Ugh, another scathing message from Galen. I was forbidden from warning them about the shutdown, and they seem rather offended. They even brought up our previous relationship. I've been wondering how to respond. I suppose I should be thankful that they have gone to visit their brother. And I have a week to formulate some sort of satisfactory response. Anema says I can be overly particular with wording, but this, but in this case, I believe it's warranted. I wonder whether Galen's brother still has Kato. I'm sure Vitus misses him, misses visiting him. Kato and Vitus, huh? Hmm. Flow Generator Division, attention to everybody. I realize you are already unhappy about the changes to the cooling channels and the additional security measures. Now, I have to provide additional bad news. Starting next week, we will be shutting down the supplies of Pyroflow to the various facilities nearby. They will need to find ways to function to function util utilizing Hydroflow, Terraflow, and Aeroflow they generate. This is non-negotiable. I understand you may worry about how you will be treated by our fellow citizens if you continue to work here. If that is the case, please come see me in my office. No, this trap needs more work. Hmm. Let's see. Hello user, please enter an action. Log in. Please enter code. Hint, dog's friend. I believe it is Kato. C, A, T, and O. Because it was the only four letter word or name that was in all of this. So that's why it, it makes sense. Ready to submit? Yes, submit. Code accepted. Menu. Welcome. Hephaestus. Messages. Recent messages from Galen. From Galen. One of two. I've wondered if our previous connection makes things like this easier or harder for you. It definitely makes them harder for me. I guess I finally got my answer when you decided to cut our flow supply without talking to me first. Even if the order came from the king himself, I thought I could still trust you enough to come to me. Lucky for us, we have enough pyro flow stocked up to keep things chugging along, at least for now. I'm mostly sending this to ask if the two of us can act normally around each other. Is it already too late for that? Okay. From Anima. Listen, dear, I know you have been struggling greatly with the decision to cut off flow supplies, but keep in mind it was not your choice. Titus and, Gal and Galen will blame you. But that is because they cannot blame anyone else. Deep down, they are well aware who is responsible. Stay strong, my love. Okay. Titus. From Titus. The gardener is already pretty upset about you cutting off his pyrojo flow supplies. I'm not sure what the king expects to happen. Does the capital want Galder or not? Does the capital want Galder or not? Galen may be approaching this issue in the wrong way. But at least he's approaching it. Stand up for us, Hef. <coughs> Excuse me. And from Admin 2. <laughs> from Admin 2. I think he was Admin 1. I know you are making sacrifices. We are all making sacrifi uh, sacrifices. The people we've lost are irreplaceable, but so are you. In this time, more than any before it, I need your faith. If we fail here, the Cosmos Protocol will be the hope for our future. Your facility will not only house a key to this secret, but provide a potential source of power to any future survivors. Hmm. Alright, messages. Welcome. Temple status. Flow generator status, critical overload. Emergency access door, powered. Cosmos Protocol, engaged. And Garden Lockdown. Engaged. Let's disengage. Garden Lockdown Protocol disengaged. Exit. Goodbye. Accepted. Keeper Roots. Alright, let's return to Einar. Whew. That was a 
lot. <laughs> mm. So now we got to return back to Einar. Easy enough, I suppose. I'll try to make this uh, direct. Yeah, that last one took us a little bit of time. It helped if I actually paid attention to the waypoint. Or the marker. Oh well. I thought maybe it was marking a different quest or something. For some reason, I didn't put one and one together. I don't know. Oh well, we got there eventually. It took some time, but we got there. We shall head. We shall head over to Einar. Looking at the time, I'm wondering if we, we unlock the Temple of Roots today and we do the temple next time question mark? I don't know. I'm trying to decide. We can check out this gardenia. Or gardenia. Looking for love? <laughs> All right. Let's talk to Einar. Sorry for aggroing all the deer on you. Just trying to get over here quick. Cricket in the sky. <laughs> it's a sky cricket. Hey, Einar. Feel free to stay and converse. You look as though you have something you'd like to ask. Hey, I fixed the lockdown protocol. Now we may uncover the facts behind this mysterious missive. Hecla has offered to accompany accompany us to our destination. I anticipate that she wants to help welcome this Galdar to Kilima as she did with you. We will meet you at the temple. I have encircled the appropriate location on your map. Thank you. You called my... Your kind called my kind Galdars. We have another name. But you wouldn't be able to pronounce it. Its syllables are only understandable in the language of flow. We must repeat this experience in the near future. We must. Let's head to the house. Let's see what we got here. And it looks like we had something in our mail. So, not the mail mail, but the dev mail, I guess. The Singularity 6 mail. Notifications. Let's call it notifications. Let's take a look. Whoops, nope. Uh, that was in that, right here. News. We sent you a gift. Thanks for playing. Yay. Flame. Wow. Guys, we got a gift. We are going to save some of this stuff. Okay. Let's put this guy. Yeah, I just want to make sure we're able to dedicate the actual time to the... The temple. I don't want to feel rushed. Oh my goodness. <gasps> we got a big guy. We got the frogs. Maybe we call this toad. Uh... 
So here will be the uh, area of toads. Rivet. <laughs> they look so funny. Oh my gosh, I love this thing. Can we climb them? No, you can't climb them. Bummer. All right, let's see if this gardenia is doing any good, any better. Have we sprouted? Has it grown? How long do you think it's gonna take? <gasps> Look, it's pretty. Oh, we gotta water it. Shoot, water the plants. There you go. Oh, suspicious symbosis. I like it. That actually looks kind of cute there. Actually worked out pretty well. <laughs> All right, let's go talk to Ani. Let's complete this quest. We'll complete one of these. How about that? The next episode, we will complete the Temple of the Roots. I think. I think that's what we're going to do. And instead of doing S Stardew this week, or the week this episode comes out, I think I'll do two, we'll, we'll post both episodes of the, um, the temple. That way you can see all the stuff leading up, and you don't have to wait a whole week for the, the actual temple itself. I think that's how I'm going to do this. I got a plan. We got a plan, guys. Who knew we actually have a plan? All right, so we need to talk to Ani. Ani is probably in town. We are really running the wrong direction. Yeah, buddy. You wouldn't believe what we did. Bugs are awesome. All those blue butterflies would be worth something. Hey, bud. Scare you off last time. <laughs> <laughs> Getting some fresh air too, huh? I grew a gardenia. Oh. No way. Najuma actually wasn't messing with me this time. Yeah. This is the coolest news I've ever heard, ever in my whole life. I have to send a letter to the Bug Scouts HQ in Bahari City right away. This is gonna blow their minds. Uh. Well, after I finish my chores. Thanks so much, Kikami. I totally gave you a new badge, uh, if I had one ready. But I guess this will do for now. So you can go out and catch some more bugs and get even more flowers and get even cooler. When I took the statue, I noticed it had those little magical inscription things on the sides. Runes, I think they're called. I thought if I could learn them, maybe it would be a step in the right direction towards passing my order test. But I was thinking, since you're human, maybe you could help me study runes instead. Stop me from stealing crazy statues in the future. I got even more fun planned for next time. So wait, so what did we get? Oh, we got some uh, bug things, bug bombs. All right. So what can we get from these? What do we get from beetles? Sheer curiosity now. Uh, all right this one gardenia flower all right do we get one every time we catch these Ooh. what does stink bugs give up get us we're gonna try all the common insects the ones we see all the time I figured that'd be a good place to start, right? That's just an everyday cricket. Let's see what he gets. This is a way to incentivize, incentivize uh, bug catching. Nope, nothing. Hmm. No, I want another bug. Where's the beetles? There's a beetle. What are you doing? Nope. Do you get one every time? 
You do. Hmm. Huh. Maybe it's just the one flower. Let's try some more stink bugs. Let's see if something else comes up. Nope. What do you get from star? Uh, do we get a star quality? Nope. No star quality gradenias. I can even see the eyes just looking at you. It's kind of creepy. <laughs> it's really kind of creepy. Well, we caught bugs for the day. Can you only have so many plants? I have no idea. We haven't gotten any new mail yet. Let's... Let's purchase some... Actually, you know what? Let's see if Ani has anything in his Bug Scout shop. I just want to go on an adventure. Oh, hey! Is there anything new in here? Oh, gardenia flower, blue hydrant, and you can buy the flowers. An anemone flower, grimalkin tail, tulips, <gasps> chapa tail, lavender, foresight, tiger lily. Okay. Sectisarium, and the lure. We really have to level this up. <laughs> All right. So that's good to know. That's actually really good to know. All right. Take me on your next adventure. <laughs> so now we got to figure out what gives what. Hmm. I am going to buy a few things. We're going to buy some milk, some flour, and some butter. We're going to get a Zeki coin. Super important. Anything here? No. Nope. 8 a.m. We did get some new furniture. We could see what it takes to craft that. I like the sundial. Does Tish have anything new? Everyone seems to have new stuff, so we should probably check this out too. Oh, Emberborn wall. We do have a new uh, wallpaper. We will get the new wallpaper. Emberborn, huh? Let's see what that looks like. And then we'll build the other... Let's build the other items. There's probably books we need to read too, but... I don't feel like reading right now. I I'm having a hard time reading. <laughs> If, unlucky th if unlocking the temple was any uh, indication, I'm having troubles reading right now. We'll leave the books for another time. I am going to put these gardenias in um, storage. I wonder if they count as decoration storage or if they take up storage spots. I like a, like a plant, you know? I'm wondering what that's going to do. And how often do we have to water these things? Do we get sprinklers? Can I auto water this thing? <laughs> I know it sounds funny, but yeah. All right. 
Let us, let's put away the gardenias. Ooh, it does count like a plant and not as a decoration. That's good to know. I am going to, oops, we can put that away. I am gonna sell the bugs real quick. So this can all go. I will hang on to the bug bombs. Okay, let's grab the rest of these weeds. Oops, that was a potato. Hmm. That's okay. That was a mistake. We'll grab a potato. There we go. Okay. There's all of this. You can sell that guy. Now, put this away. Let's see what those uh, recipes were. What were they called? Uh, let's go never crafted. They weren't ember born. It wasn't the gourmet dessert plate. We do have the gourmet set there. Yeah, spring fever. That's what it was. So that's going to take nine light bulbs. Then we got the swing and the wheelbarrow. What's the swing take? A hundred of those. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. I'm curious. And we got a lot, so. We can always uh, chop more wood, right? Let's make this the spring fever swing. There is a whole set. Look at this. <gasps> Ooh. Let's grab this guy. The Fever Flat Trellis. These take so much. My goodness. Let's make the wheelbarrow. Let's lock unlock something else. Let's unlock. What do you think this is? This looks cool. Woo! Fever Rock Stack. Okay, we got a rock stack. I picked that because, well, we have a lot of rocks and maybe we'll unlock another item. I like how this is all... <gasps> is this that? I'm so excited. <laughs> yes. Yes, we are completely doing this. Let's add another one of those. Oh my goodness, we're gonna be in trouble. All right, no, we did, I don't know, I want the pergola. Yes, please. And we got all the lights. Let's see what this is. Chimenea. Furniture making is now level 12. Oh shoot, we gotta eat. Can we make the chimenea? Yes, let's make this as well. There's more. <gasps> There's so much more. Wood edging. Huh. What do you suppose that is? Times 20. Ooh. Oh no, I like this. This could be interesting. Let's see what this does. Um, I'm gonna grab the light. I'm assuming that's a lamp, yeah. What's required for the lamp? We're gonna see what this looks like. Then we got this. Is this a stone edging? A rock edging. Ooh. Yeah, we're gonna craft all this. We're so 
killing all of our resources. A fire pit? Can we get the fire pit? No, we need more rock. All right, we got some goals. We got a lot of outdoor decorations. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, this is way better than that. Yes. I'm sorry, this is way better than this guy. Gee. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Six. Yes! Can we put it down here somewhere where it's not gonna... Yes? I love it. Absolutely love it. We're gonna scoot... Whoops. We're gonna scoot this guy back a little bit. I wish I could scoot up a little bit. Whoa! Nope. Yes. <gasps> Check that out. Ah! Ah! Beat still. I'm so excited. Oh, I want to put this by there too! I want this instead of... Oh, that would look so cool there. This is going to require some, uh, finagling, though. Alright, uh, we'll pick that up. Shoot. Alright, we're going to have to move some of this. This is the end of our, uh... <laughs> Sorry, guys, you're going to have to deal with my... Can I put it right there? Yes, okay. So now, can we put this... Yes, we can. Kinda... How about right there? Oh, facing out? Right there like that. We need to put these guys kinda close back here. Cause I did like them. I really liked having them back here. Froggy. Hey, Froggo. You know what? Let's scoot this back to about, how about right here? Let's have this facing out. Oh, um, Froggo. There we go. Nope. How about right there? And Froggo, you can sit right here. Maybe. There we go. We got that right there. Ah, oh, I'm loving it. Absolutely loving it. And then we got our big froggo. <laughs> Five. What do we have here? It's just a cute little, cute little statue we can set. Maybe we move this over here. We put it over here by our gardenias. Maybe we'll put it, no, nope, no, nope. yeah. Sure. And then we got our four. Let's check out this wheelbarrow. It's not too bad. I think I kind of like the other one. I think the other one looks better. Yeah, that one's a kind of a miss for me, I know. <gasps> Ooh. Where do we want to put this? This is kind of cool. How about over here by our little sitting area? I think we move this. Kinda how about back here. This guy here can kinda sit. Like 
back a little bit. There. Now you can sit and chill. And then this edging. Ooh. All right. So we have this right here for our garden. What if, no. Nope. What if we did? No. <laughs> what do I pick up? Let's start right here. Wait. Oh, we don't have enough fence pieces. All right. Well, what do we think of it? Let's move it. You can easily walk around it. So that's good. That's kind of cool. Let's see. What does the two? What's the rock edging look like? That's a thought as well. Ooh, pick it up. Let's see. Can we do rocket? No. Nope. Two. Doll. Oh. Can only go in squares. Okay. like here. Kind of looks cool there. I think it might be a little difficult to place, but it's not bad. The stones and the, uh, hmm. Okay, so we're gonna have to think about that. That is a serious thought. And then one, let's see. Ooh, these lights look nice. I kind of like these over the other ones. They look a little bit more uh, modern. Let's just place them and see what they no. let's just place them and see what they look like. No. One. Yes. Alright, we may have to make some more of those as well. Because I do like those. Those are kind of cool. I don't know where we're gonna put this one for now, but. Can I place it in here? No, has to be outside. All right, makes sense. I'll just put it kind of right there for right now. All right. Well, that's kind of neat. Oh, we got the wallpaper yet, too. We got one wallpaper to check out. Let's drop the chopping meat off. Boop. Put this away, put this away. I am going to put... Oh, we got rocks laying around here somewhere. Where are those rocks? They're right here. 
I do like those. But we're going to pick them up for right now. I think maybe we put rocks... Maybe we line our uh, thing with rocks. That would look cool. All right, let's look at this wallpaper. Tish's new wallpaper. Ooh. It's kind of a nice color. It's very um, brown. But it looks nice. I like how it has a lower, a lower spot there. I wonder, can we put it down there? We could make the bottom of the house look like that. That would look cool. It's not a bad look to the outside. Not a valid placement. What do you mean? Yeah, it does have an interesting look to it, doesn't it? Eh, well, it's good to see it. Oops. Let's put this away. I don't think we're going to use it, which is sad, but I don't think we're going to use it right now. So next time we are definitely going to do the Temple of the Roots. And we will see what we have in store for um, other... You know, what, what the collection is, because you know there's going to be a collection. So we need to figure out the collection. After that, I think we will either update the house, because we added the room, so we have a little bit of work to do. Or, yeah. Anyways, I think we're going to do the Temple of, Root, uh, Temple of the Roots next time. That, that is an absolute given. So with that... I will catch you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a really, really great rest of your day as well. Talk to you later. Goodbye. Thank you so much for watching my video. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe for more content as it greatly helps out my channel. Hope to see you soon.